Lindsay with Emeralds of Fairy Lights and I'm here today for Thrills and Chills Thursday. And today, if you're if you're wondering what Thrills and Chills is, that's part of the Festival of Witches, an event that I'm hosting on my channel. And if you'd like any more information about that, I will have it linked down below. But today, what we are doing is unboxing a diamond painting from Carrot Art. And this one is a new release. Um, as I've said on my channel, this company um, is now licensing artwork. And so they definitely have a section of licensed artwork. And you guys, um, I'm loving a bunch of the artists that they've signed. And I am so excited to see what else they have in store for us. So this is one of the new releases. And let's go ahead and look at it. This is called Sun and Moon. It's a 50 by 70, and I believe this one is a square, but we will see. <laughs> but isn't it so fun? I love it. And I'll tell you a little bit more why I like this one so much. So if you guys have watched my channel, you know I'm a bit of a fan of fan art. Now this one is not fan art particularly, but it reminded me of a book. So let's go ahead and look and see what we have. Is there anything else in there? Okay, nope. So um, I did want to let you guys know that um, Carrot.Art does provide an option to get a toolkit. You do have to click that you would like one on their site, so just remember that. Another thing is Carrot.Art is a German company. I know lots of you have to deal with just extremely um, ridiculous shipping prices from the US or Canada or Asia or Australia um, and so this is great for Europeans so um let's go ahead and look at this so it looks like we do have the name of the kit or at least the code of the kit on this bag and it is nicely wrapped in it to keep it safe a rather crinkly bag. Looks like we do get some carrot washi tape, which is really fun. That was in the kit. And then um, I'm looking at it right now. It looks like we definitely get a soft backing with scalloped and poked edges. And um, it looks like there's a little bit of something on there, but it looks like it's probably just glue. Um, right down here, we have a 10% off coupon. We've got their website as well as the name of the artist and um, also the picture. So you can know this is legally licensed. The artist is being compensated and has given their permission to use this image. And so let's pull out what's in the center. Um, so we do have our drills right here and then we have a sticker legend. So right away, look at, you get a really nice big picture and you get, looks like there's 69 colors in this kit. You can see, um, the symbols there. These are all individually cut so you could put them on your containers. I love that. Um, it looks like these drills also do come in baggies already and so... Um, you could just put these stickers on the baggies if you like to work with baggies or put them on containers. Um, so that is really neat. Now looking at this, we can see that they've added a bunch of ABs in here. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven ABs in this kit, which we'll definitely have to look and see where that goes. Um, I am going to roll this kit backwards and give you guys a pan of it and then we'll be back to look at it a little bit more. So look at it, how fun is it? And I love that it's laying so flat so quickly. Um, if you guys see any crinkles in the plastic, that is totally just the plastic cover. Um, this is a poured glue canvas, so you shouldn't have issues with the glue, like bubbles or rivers, like you would with a double-sided adhesive. Um, you get a legend on either side of your canvas, which I know lots of people really like. And the printing looks so clear. I see that um, it's a little bit I love that I love seeing very clear printing and especially on symbols like this where oh sorry it's getting blurry <laughs> I'm 
in the camera. So where you have symbols like this, um, where they can be hard to read, they're so clear. Um, yeah. So um, let's go ahead and look at the drills on this one. But really quickly, I just wanted to tell you guys why I loved this one was um, if you saw that I had, I unboxed recently some Aquatar fan art. If you're unfamiliar with that, that's A Court of Thorns and Roses. Um, so I unboxed that, but from the same author, the original book series that I read was the Throne of Glass series. And this one to me looked like it could be Selena and Nehemia, if you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> um, I know definitely Nehemia of the Sun Kingdom, um, but, but definitely like, you know, and, and Selena the one with many names. Anyway, I just thought this was really fun and it'd be fun to unbox these in the same week because it's similar things. It's book fan art or whatever like that that kind of attracted me to this artwork. Otherwise though, I think it's beautiful. I love the representation of the sun and the moon. Um, and anyway, so um, let's get ahead, go ahead and look at the drills. So both of these drill bags do have the coat on it in case you want to store your drills and canvas separately. You can see the lovely ABs in there. Okay, let's, so let's go through these drills. And it looks like we have got on here, we've got the number on the legend as well as the DMC code. And I believe this is the weight. So we have got 932, 922, 921, 827, 826, 823, and these drills look really, really nice. We've got 819, 813, we've got 807, 791, 782, 781, 400, 356, and again, we're getting a lot of these really flat backs, the flat bottoms up against the bag, which you can see, which is so nice for diamond painting. Love it. Okay, we've got third, 355, 353, 336, 318, 317, 310, just a small bag of it, 300, 225, 162, 161, 160, and 159. Moving on to the second bag. We have got two bags of 5200, this white, 3863, 3861, 3779, 3778, and 3771. Looks like we've got eight B's right here. So, or maybe I'll leave these to the end. I'll just show the regular DMC. 3766, 3761, 3752, 3747, 
3371, 3042, 972, 951, 948, 945, and two large bags of 939. And then we have got 938. So that is that for your regular square drills. They are looking so nice. You can see all those flat bottoms. <laughs> okay, so for the ABs, we are going to get 444, 740, 819, 3766, 3841, 5200, and then we have 743 AB. So um, I think these are going to probably be just so beautiful. Looking at this canvas, um, you can see right here that the 5200, which is the white, is this um, x out symbol with a circle. And I can tell you right now that it's going to be featured anywhere you see white, you're gonna find it. So. What's neat is, like I said, these kind of go back and forth. So you're going to see it mainly on this side, but you're going to see some in this side as well. So in her dress, you're going to see that symbol all over, if you can see that. In her hair a little bit, you're going to see it. Again, up here in her sleeves. There is one in her eye. And then there are some in the stars in the sky, as well as some in the moon. So not the entire moon, which will be pretty, but there will just be little flakes in the moon as well. Again, in these stars. And then over the side on the sun side, it's definitely going to be in here um, around her head. You're going to see that. So um, that will be really pretty. And then it looks like the... Um, just trying to see right here. So this 444 AB is going to be this line right here. And you're gonna find that it's like down here in her dress. You're gonna find it up here in her dress. That's gonna be really pretty. I think it's, it's gonna be up here in her necklace. Um, and then it's going to be in her um, crown, I guess. Or her sun, her sun crown, you know. <laughs> um, so it's definitely going to be in there. Now this number seven forty three is going to be these two little dots, and that is this color. That one is again going to be found in her dress, along with that yellow. So that's going to be pretty. You're going to have multiple AVs next to each other to give it tone and definition. You're going to have it again in here, the 743 with those dots, and then in some of these lighter crown pieces right there, you're going to find those double dots. Now for 740, which is going to be the arrow right here, pointing to the corner. That one you are going to find again up here in the crown. You can see they're just going to really complement each other, I believe. And then down here, there is going to be some in the necklace in the orange part. You can see those. And then there is going to be some all around in this area of her. And let's see, is there any down here in the dress? There's not a ton of that one that I can, I mean, I think it's sprinkled in all throughout. So then looking at 819, this is going to be the symbol K and it's, did I even get that in the camera frame? So K is going to be, I can see little K's like in this, especially this part of her sleeve. Can you see those sprinkled in there? I think that's going to be really pretty. You're going to have shades of light purple, pink, and light blue in there, and that's going to be gorgeous. I was looking to see if there's any in her face. I don't see any in the face, um, so I think that's about it, that right there. 
about. There might be some sprinkled elsewhere, but that is for that light pink, which leads us to these two blues. And I'm going to show you guys those together just because um, I'll show you right here. We've got a triangle and a lollipop symbol. And these are all over her dress. Um, you're going to see them. If you can just, like anywhere on her dress, you can kind of see lollipops. Um, you can see the triangles a little bit farther up. Um, but if you can just see, there's lollipops all throughout the sleeves. Um, we've got the triangles right here. So in the darker blue areas, you're gonna find the triangles. Um, and then you are going to find them right here in this side of the sun. And you're going to find them again right here in the sun. So that will be pretty. So, you guys, those are the ABs. I think this is such a fun kit. This one looks like it is um, definitely a mix of confetti and color blocking. I can definitely see huge swaths of color blocking and then intense confetti like right here in, the, in her hair. Um, I just, I've been seeing some of these completed of care art and they look beautiful. Um, I'm so excited to see how this one turns out. Let me know um, what you guys think and if you have purchased from Carrot.Art. Um, I'd love to hear what you've gotten or what you're looking at. Um, I am so excited about this company. But I hope you guys have a great day today and I will see you in another video soon. Bye!